Hey friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Danielle, but you can call me Donnie B. If you have not done so already, I ask you to please drop down, hit that subscribe button. Also turn on your post notifications so you don't miss out when I post and upload. I promise you're gonna love it here. I am about to go out of town. I'm gonna get up first thing in the morning um, to leave to go out of town. My little sister, she's having a gender reveal and the only person that knows what the gender of the baby is, is me. So I, of course, have to be there for the gender reveal, and plus I would never miss out on it because I love my sissy Chrissy. All right, but before I leave, I have a, quite a few things that I need to do in order to get my house organized so I don't come back to a complete disaster. Number one being my dishes. As you can see, my counter is a mess. Dishes still all in the sink, so I have to go ahead and get those um, washed. So I'm going to go ahead and put those in the dishwasher. And also, I have quite a few loads of laundry that I need to do. Hold on. I know it's dark. Bear with me for just a minute. I got quite a few loads of laundry. That's just some of it. I still have quite a bit in my drop stations. And then I have more laundry over there. But that's some of it. But like I said, it's a whole bunch more in my, the drop station in my room alone because my husband changed clothes like three times a day. And I joke with him all the time about him changing clothes three times a day. But I be serious. I'm going to go ahead and get started because it is already late. Um, it is late and so um, I'm getting a late start. It's like 7 o'clock. And I still have to make some treats for the, um, the baby showers. So I have to dip some pretzels and um, dip some Oreos and uh something else, some popcorn i have to dip some popcorn or de decorate some popcorn um that's probably going to be in another vlog if i include that if i vlog that it's going to be in another vlog me um getting prepped and prepared for that so if you see me in this outfit again mind your business i bet record over here so um let's get started starting out with the dishes and i'm basically going to reset my house um reset everything so when i come in uh, for the beginning of the week, everything is already done when I come back home on Sunday. So this is going to be my reset for the week, but earlier. Before we get into this video, I would like to give a big thank you out there to all of my supporters. I really, really appreciate you guys. You have no idea um, how important and how good it feels to have people that are constantly supporting you, especially on this platform. You put so much time and effort into it, and then sometimes you don't get back the same um, um response as as effort as you put into the videos and so for those of you who are consistently showing up and showing out for me i i really really appreciate it all right so let's go ahead and get into this video so i am going to start out with first washing the dishes i'm going to be putting them in the dishwasher and i'm here to tell you as well that this video is a prime example of things not always going as planned i had so many great aspirations and so many big plans for this night and honestly it did not go as planned um i got tired in the end and so i just did what i could and i would advise for you to do the same as well things may not always go as planned you may have more things planned out for yourself than you have time and everything for but as long as you do as much as you can that is the best that you can do so after i have all of the my dishes placed into the dishwasher and i get it going i'm going to head on over to my laundry room and i am going to start on um, my first load of laundry and that of course would be the kids clothes if you watch my videos you know that i always start out with the kids clothes so everything that's here in the hamper as well as their blankets those blankets are the blankets that they take to school and so i take i have them um, send them to me once a week at the end of the week and I wash them in some all sensitive free and clear laundry detergent now once that load has finished washing I'm going to go ahead and put them in the dryer and I'm going to start off with the next load Then 
this basket right here is the result of one of my drop stations I am about to wash my tiles and I knew that I had more tiles than what's listed this what's shown here in this sorter so I went and I went over to my drop stations to gather everything um, and not just the tiles I just grabbed everything and so while I'm sorting these out really quickly I'm going to go ahead and pull out all of my towels and I do this just so I can avoid you know just washing only a few clothes at a time And here is my little helper. He always looks for an opportunity or a way to help and I really appreciate that and I'm going to take as much advantage of that now as I can because I know when it becomes a chore for him he's not going to want to do it and also this helps with his development. Now I have this stool that I'm going to try to have him stand on and um, we do have a taller stool but this stool just was not quite tall enough. Um, but I'm going to do what I can because he wants to be really involved. As you can see, he's eager to help out. I'm going to help him, uh, have him help me place some of the products into the washing machine. Carter and I have that load of towels going. I'm going to take this time out to sort the rest of the clothes that are here in the basket. So when I get ready to wash, I already have those sorted out for me and ready to go. I don't know about you and I'm sure some of you are guilty of it and you're not going to make me think that I am the only one but when usually during um, on laundry day or when I'm doing laundry there's always that last load of clothes that always tends to hang around in the dryer until the next wash day. How many of you are guilty of leaving um, that last load or leaving a load of clothes in the dryer? For me, the hardest part about laundry day is actually folding them up and putting them up. It's so tedious, but it also makes things so much more organized when I get ready to go and pick out the boys' outfits or when I get ready to go and pick out my outfits. And I'm pretty proud of myself when I look and see the organization after I finally put the time and effort into folding and putting everything up. She need me like heartbeat, drive me the bed like a RV. Her 
hugging the curves on that body She bring the heat like wasabi Promise not to test your heart Never. We just can't be kept apart Yeah, yeah Baby, you the best by far Always go the extra mile Yeah, yeah If you have made it this far, please make sure that you have subscribed to my channel and make sure that your post notifications are turned on. If you've made it this far, I'm sure you like what you see and so there's plenty more where this came from. Also, you can follow me over on Instagram. I post there at least three times a week of different things that are going on with me. And I'm trying to make my Instagram more about me and this channel more about, you know, me sprinkled in with a little family. And so I'm really enjoying my journey on Instagram and I would love for you guys to join me. Why you wanna run away? Why you gotta be I wish I could make you stay Cause baby I love you Why you tryna break us up When I'm tryna build it up I wish I could make you stop Cause baby I love you Guess I'm gonna dance alone tonight I'm gonna miss your body You know I can never get it right Without you, no I don't wanna step into the light Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Donnie B TV. On your way out, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, enjoy your day. <laughs>